In today's video, I am going to show you a Google Chrome extension called OneTab. This extension can help you organize your tabs while browsing the internet. You can also organize your set of tabs for later use. For example, you are an online teacher and you open certain tabs when you are teaching a particular subject. And there are five tabs. So using one tab, you can organize those five tabs with the subject name or any name you want. It will save you time. It will make you more productive. So you can type Chrome store in Google. And inside this Chrome store, you type one tab and press enter. And this is the Chrome extension you want to use. And this Chrome extension has already been added to my browser. But you will see add to Chrome in this blue button. So you click on that and it will be installed. And the text on the button will change to remove from Chrome. Now once the extension is installed, then you can click on this icon. And this is one tab extension. I can pin this to my browser and it will appear here. This is one tab icon. And now I will open a few tabs. And now let us say I have a lot of tabs open in my browser. If I click on this one tab, you will see that slowly all those tabs will disappear and they will appear inside this one tab. As the name suggests that now we have only one tab. So these are the seven tabs which were opened in my browser and now I have all those seven tabs inside one tab. Previously, I have already put few tabs inside one tab. As you can see, two tabs, three tabs and so on. Now let us assume that when I teach mathematics, I open these seven tabs and I want to save some time so I can give this tab group a name. To do that, I click on more, then name this tab group. A text box will open and I can give it a name, for example, math tabs. Then I also want to lock this tab group. So I click on lock this tab group and a lock will appear here. And now next time when I start teaching mathematics, I can click on restore all. I can save some time. With one click of a button, all these seven tabs have been opened and my tab group is still available inside one tab extension. But make sure that you lock this group. Otherwise, when you will restore these seven tabs, they will disappear from this Chrome extension and their group name will also disappear. So when you want to organize a set of tabs for your online teaching session, or when you are having, for example, a meeting with your team members and you want to open certain set of tab, then you must also lock the name of that tab group. And let me show you, uh, these are two tabs. And if I restore these, what happens? A new window will open and those two tabs will appear in that window because I have already opened these seven tabs in this window. So if I try to restore any other group of tabs, a new window will open and you will also notice that that particular group has disappeared from this one tab extension because we have restored it. So if you want to save a group, give it a name and lock that group. Now you can also delete this set of tabs by simply clicking on delete all. It will confirm and if I click OK, those three tabs will disappear. So one tab is a Chrome extension which helps you organize your tabs. I can simply teach my math lesson and I can keep closing all these tabs and my seven tabs will always be stored inside one tab. And if I click this again, a new group of these three tabs will be created. So let's do that. If I click on that, you can see that a new group has been created. So you don't have to bring your logged tabs again inside one tab. And another important thing is that you can bring any tab from one group of tabs to another group of tabs simply by dragging. So let's say I drag this and I bring it here. So it will be added to my math tabs. Now let's click on this options button. And in this area, you have certain options and you can read this and you can decide what type of options you want in your one tab Chrome extension. But most of the times these default options are good enough. Now one option you should be paying attention to and that is 
how you want to treat pinned tabs and pin tabs is that for example this is any tab if i right click on this i can pin this tab now this tab is pinned and by default this pin tab will not be brought into your one tab extension if i click on that it will have no effect because that tab is pin tab and that is available at this corner if i click here my pin tab will appear in this area if you want to change this behavior you can click on options and you can allow pinned tabs to be sent to one tab application let us close these options you can also star your tab groups by clicking on more and then star this tab group and a star will appear beside the name of the group now you can share any particular group of tabs with your students as well if you click on this share all as a web page then all of your group of tabs inside one tab will be shared but if i want to share only my math tabs to my math students i can simply click on share as web page and now these seven tabs can be shared by this qr code which is the best way to share this you can copy paste this and if you are in a live session your students can scan this qr code with their smartphone camera and all these seven tabs will be opened in their browser very simple so this is highly productive this saves you a lot of time and you can arrange all set of tabs inside one tab very easily so let's close this now if i click on this export import urls i will get the url of all these websites which are in all these tabs and now i can copy paste these urls and send to my student or any particular url if i want i can also import urls i just put url here by copy pasting from somewhere else and then those will be available inside my one tab so one tab is a very useful google chrome extension to organize group of tabs for online teaching for project management or for any other purpose so i hope that you like this video if so please give it a thumbs up thanks for watching and see you next time